We teach these girls right. Yeah, I got your attention now, didn't I? You won't be working down there either. The Bible says, train up a child the way they should go. When they're old, they'll not depart from the ways thereof. Okay? But if, if we mislead in our churches, boys, this applies to you too. Because the girls won't work if boys are not involved. It takes two to tangle. It is prostitution. God's word says what it is, it's sin. God is, has been against it from the beginning. We call it prostitution, we call it brothels. God's word calls it whores, calls it whorehouses. Yes, I understand most churches, oh, don't say prostitute, don't say this, don't say the word hell, even in church, because my kid, and we had a family leave here about, about four years ago because I used the word whore. What in the world are they hearing in school? A whole lot more than that. And in the phone book at that point in time, the churches was on one page of the phone book and whorehouses on the other page in the phone book. And yet mama didn't want it heard in church. It was okay to phone book. It's okay to watch this stuff on TV. It's okay to hear it at school. Well, if we can't discuss it at church, we got problems. We used to have a woman, remember this church, and she stood up in this church one day and said that we needed the whorehouses so our husbands can have safe sex. Husband can have safe sex if he's home where he ought to be having the safe sex. When a man goes and does what he does, if he's married, he's taking money out of the kids' mouths. Something is going to be left undone at home. change or work helps a lot. I don't have any change. Don't they? You're not giving any oh. change anyways. I don't sell my ass to feed him. I sell my ass to feed my kids. He can sell his own ass. Nobody wants to buy his ass. I was a very ugly kid. Very ugly. I had a huge overbite, like massive, massive overbite. I got teased a lot, a lot. You know, there was a time when my name was synonymous with ugly in my school. They'd be like, oh, you're so ugly. You're as ugly as Kitty. Ow! You're such a jerk. <laughs> Such a you're done with kisses. You're a tease. I've got enough germs. How are you? A, how can you be a <laughs> tease with me? Because I love you. Oh, so you're gonna tease I me? I cuddle with you. I don't cuddle with anybody else. Maybe I don't want cuddling. <laughs> I, was, maybe I didn't marry you for the cuddling. You get other stuff too. Do I? Yeah. You can't drink that? Uh, Why not? I've drunk over like a year. Are you a Where's girly the, uh, man? Salt? I'm a lightweight. This, this is my no, fifth tonight. What? Here, take that one. I can drink though. I'm you're, a pro. You're a bad person. Yeah. I'm a pro. So you're I pro? drink at work. Uh, it's part of my job. My work is fun. I just sit around and drink and have sex and I get paid for it. Do what? I, I work at the chicken ring. That's awesome. It's down by Vegas. It's a brothel. It's a whorehouse. I'm a whore. <laughs> <laughs> You well, drunk. at least you are uh, <laughs> honest about it. No, but I'm legal. Confident. I'm licensed. Exactly. Yeah. You, you get licensed with that kind of stuff? Yeah, I have, yeah. A, I have a license for Do the county I work in. Do you ever come up to uh, Colleen, Texas? No. <laughs> no? I well, can't me... work outside of you will the make brothel a lot of I money. work Trust in. me, you will make a lot of money. I do make a lot. <laughs> no, 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 no. You think you make a lot of money? Trust me. Trust me. It's tough, I see. Uh, it's good, though. You guys come in, I'll give you a discount. They're army guys. Army guys get 10% discount. Uh, well, how does that work for you since you're married? Oh, it's not that big of a deal. I mean, when I work, I go to the brothel and I, I actually live there. I don't know how is it for you. Tell her why it's not that big of a deal. Well, we were swingers before. 
That is outstanding. And I'm bi. That's fucking so awesome. I have sex that's with girls You guys anyways. are awesome. Dude, that's, that's outstanding. <laughs> Bones. 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 Yeah. Bones. So pretty much yeah. now I'm just getting paid for it. I am so happy. Are you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm very sorry for what happened. I, I did not enjoy that happening. I wouldn't want it's to get so back to you that I um, said this and I said that. And actually, I, the only thing that got back to me was that you actually did scold Rachel on that. Yes. She was an opportunist and she found nothing yes. more than the opportunity to take her mark. She admitted me. that fully, too. Yeah, she said, you know, well, we know she's a piece of shit. She so. admitted that, too, by the way. Yeah. yeah. She called herself a selfish bitch. And, and well, great. So she's self-deserving of that title, but just because you you now readily admit, that doesn't save my $85,000 a year job, but that opens another door for me. I'm starting my new job. What's your new job? Cherries. Yeah. You know, six years ago, they told me they didn't hire women over 40. right Oh, And five years ago, I didn't do well because they were teasing me, calling me a man. But you know what? I'm five years smarter. I'm 20 pounds less than I was five years ago. I have new teeth and a new image about life, OK? Uh-uh. This time, I have, to, listen, I have to make it work, Rose. I've got few options left for me. And I'm not going to look at it that way. So much stress. You know, I'm a new chick on the block. I'm working with twice as many girls as I'm used to, 24 girls. And I'm third string. They close a bar at three, which means if a gentleman comes in after three, they're calling you on the house phone. Gabby, could you come out and talk to this gentleman? I'm on the walk list, which means when a man selects a woman, takes her to the room, it doesn't flow with the negotiation, she walks him back to the lovely parlor. Ding, ding. Gabby, would you like to discuss? Sure. I did not do well. Half of what I'm accustomed making I embrace change, but I miss the camaraderie. I miss the dog. I miss the dog. I know the dog thinks I probably forgot about her. You were so drunk and blunt last night. Bleed over. It was funny, because you were telling everybody, I'm a hooker. I wasn't, I didn't say it like that. No, you did. No, I you did. did. You said it to a couple people, I'm a hooker. Well. And those guys bought you all those drinks for free. Yep. That was cool. That was cool. It was a little weird, though. It was a little weird. Having you yell, I'm a hooker, in front of a bar full of people. I didn't yell it. No, you, you were pretty drunk. You said it pretty loud. So? I don't know, are you, are you upset? Not really. Did I embarrass you? Well, a little bit. I'm sorry. Legal. I, I, should, I shouldn't have to hide. I'm not breaking any laws. I'm not hurting anybody. If they don't like it, then don't fucking talk to me. You know, I'm sure they would have loved to throw me out. That's how I felt. Like, they, they would have wanted to, I'm sure. But they can't throw me out because then, of course, I would have called a lawyer because that's discrimination. And I wouldn't have let them throw me out of a damn convention because of what I do for a living, especially when it's legal. I mean, this, this surprises me, the anime thing. Just really, really surprises you. I'm not supposed to go to an anime convention? I mean, I expected some people to have a problem with it. Like, if my kids' teachers found out, I would expect them to treat me a little off. That wouldn't surprise me. 
Sometimes I get a little embarrassed at first that my wife is a prostitute because there is that stigma that goes along with